next exercise number 4 draw the front view top view of cone front view top view of cylinder front view top view of hexagonal prism and front view top view of pentagonal pyramid first cone cone base 80 mm diameter height 150 mm so cone 80 mm diameter so i choose center diameter specify center point give a click on the screen then 80 then cylinder also 80 mm so center diameter give a click 80 then hexagonal prism hexagon size of 40 mm so i choose polygon option polygon hexagon number of side 6 edge option so i give a click here then by rotating mouse i bring the object in position then hexagon size is 40 mm 40 enter then pentagon to draw pentagon select polygon number of side 5 edge option give a click on the screen then 50 pentagon side is 50 mm then move the object and keep in position then select line command draw a horizontal line for approximate distance this distance is approximate value draw a horizontal line then select line command extend the circle quadrant above the horizontal line Similarly, you extend the circle quadrant and also this hexagon corners point you extend line above the Then you join the pentagon center to the corners. Then trim the part of the line above this above this horizontal line then select line command and draw a line between these two points Then height is given 150 for all the solid. So for cone, draw 150 line. For cone, draw 150 line from this midpoint. Give a click 150 for cylinder 150. So give a click and move vertically upwards then type 150 and give enter for code.
ஃபர்கோன் அண்டு பெண்டகன் ஃபர்கோன் அண்டு பிரமீட் ட்ரா ஏ லைன் ஒன் ஃபிஃப்டி அட் தி மிட் பாயிண்ட் தென் செலக்ட் லைன் கமாண்ட் அண்ட் ஜாயின் தீஸ் டூ பாயிண்ட்ஸ் So this is the front view and the top view of the cone, cylinder, prism and the pyramid. Then using linear dimension, you dimension the height for all the solid. Then the side of the pentagon and the side of the hexagon also you dimension using linear then using radi diameter you dimension the circle using the diameter you dimension the circle then using a text single line text specify start point then give text height angle 0 then type cone then click on the next place then type cylinder then click on the next place next then type hexagonal give enter for next line hexagonal prism and hexagonal prism and pentagonal pyramid and finally you give all dimensions are in m then give another click on the screen then give escape Thank you.